Hole number 10. A reachable par 5 with deceptive difficulty requires finding the fairway off the tee. An uphill second shot to a well-bunkered green demands accuracy from the long hitter. A well-placed fairway bunker short and left also demands accuracy when laying up. Once on this undulating green, you will find many tough pin locations. Hole number 11. This short new par 3 is characterized by a creek that flows down the left side of a spacious two-tiered green. The hole appears simple from the tee, but the front right bunker and runoffs to each side turns routine par to a bogey. Hole number 12. Enjoy this view as you place your tee in the ground. From the forward tees, a simple tee shot is tightened by strategic bunkers left and right. The back tees require a solid hit to carry the hazard on this par four. The approach is uphill to an oblong green, which is guarded by a signature bunker from center to right. Hole number 13. This par three is characterized by a spacious but demanding Redan style green from front right to back left. A front left bunker makes the green seem smaller. The opening front right is a gateway to feed the tee shot down to most pin locations. Take your par and move on. Hole number 14. Bunkers right on this par four and OB left. Create a demanding tee shot. Once in the fairway, the player is challenged again on the approach to a green laying at a slight angle to the fairway with bunkers right and left requiring accurate club selection. Hole number 15. Don't let your short yardage on the scorecard fool you about this downhill dog leg left par four. The tee shot is tight and the green even tighter. With OB left and a hazard long, many think birdie from the fairway and leave with bogey. Hole number 16. Uphill from tee to green on this par four calls for a well-struck tee shot guarded by bunkers left. Then, the uphill approach is made to a semi-blind green accented by bunkers out of bounds left and long. Hole number 17. This par four has a longer and shorter option. It can play its traditional longer slight dog leg left challenged by bunkers left and mounds right from the tee. New and shorter tees give the option of a drivable par four to the largest green on the course. Each option, long or short, is a different examination. Finally, hole number 18. This par four finish is uphill and dog-legged to right with the tee shot protected by a large bunker and mounds right. A larger and long mound left guards out of bounds, but can yield an awkward stance. Trees down the right tighten the approach to the two-tiered green, protected by two front bunkers and out of bounds left and long.